Hello everyone and welcome back to Bad Dream Coma. We're on chapter 7 and I feel like we're getting close to the end. I'm not sure. We're in chapter 7, the old house. And the old house, for some reason, brings us back to the forest and I'm guessing, I could be wrong, but I'm guessing the old house is the area where we made the poison the first time we visited the forest. Because if you recall, this is where we drove on out of here with that car that we stole. Don't punch the rabbit, we learned that last time. I don't really understand the point of the rabbit, but if you punch him, you have to suffer the consequences within the bad ending. But I think we'll be fine without punching the rabbit. If we go all the way through here, this just says go away. Can I scribble you out? Yes, I can. But that makes my pen go away. So scribbling that out, and then the rabbit's gone. So I can't punch the rabbit anymore, but scribbling, scribbling that out makes that go away. And then what is where I get stuck because you might remember at the ending of the last episode hello guy can I take anything out of you at the ending of the last episode we got about here because we we're just like oh my god we've made it so far and then I and then I quit the video and then I didn't realize what I had to do next so at this point at this juncture I need to poke around in here try to find something that'll interact with something oh what's this what is this? Can I burn anything over here? I did find something over here, which maybe we can do something with. Nothing with the items that I have, though, so I'm gonna poke around here and see what I can find. Oh, what is this? Okay, so when I go all the way back, this is torn down for some reason. And now I have a scissors. <laughs> We're breaking fourth wall big time here. So, we got a scissors. Let's go see what we can go choppy 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 up over here, right? Maybe I can cut up this picture. Aha! Uh -huh. And then maybe, seeing as how I get it now, he was right here, and that part of the game is missing. I'm warning you. Uh oh. Well, I'm warning you! Then I'm coming to get you. So now I can go over this way because we put the picture back. That's kind of cool. I'm digging there. Oh, God. It don't look the same, man. This don't look the same at all. Would you shut up, you frog? That's a frog, right? Okay, so. What do I even need to do here? Oh! It's a treasure map. Okay. So if the map is in there, top secret treasure map. There's a key. And a hole. And a tree hole. <laughs> okay, so I gotta find myself a tree hole. Why, hello there, tree hole. Ah, uh, no. Okay. F oh, no. What do we got here? Got an outhouse for sure. What can I all do? All sorts of goodies to go ahead and investigate. Dude, I love this. So, how do I open you, huh? Not with that. You're locked for some reason. Oh, oh, I popped a hole into something. I need to figure out how to get into these things. Can't go down into there quite yet. Baby's kind of in the way. Can I cut the baby? <laughs> Can I scare the baby? Can I crowbar the baby? Can I do anything? Oh, 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 I thought I could do something with the glove for some reason. Doesn't look like I could do anything with the baby. But I can also do something with that mailbox, which is interesting. Anything else to touch around in here? Doesn't quite look like it, but maybe we'll find something. But I want to go inside here. Okay, never mind. Baby said no. So how the hell are we going to deal with the kid? Does it need a diaper? I got an outhouse over here. I don't think they keep diapers in the outhouse, though. Oh, wait a second. I can cut... I can cut the key out of here. Oh. Oh. I thought I had to find the key. Excuse me. So I guess that's where I put the key. Maybe. I don't know. Well, let's go try to find ourselves a tree. Which is looking for a key. Unless you're talking right here, but I didn't think so. Oh, here we go. So I put the key in the mailbox. And then there's a pass in here. So will you let me pass now? Oh! He lets me pass now. Okay. Oh, okay. Is that whole whatever the hell it is you're making gonna stop that noise? Oh, hello, Death. How you doing? Oh, hi. Can I take a look at that? What do you want me to do with that little moon you just put there? Don't laugh at me. What the heckers? What's the point of that? I can't do anything in here. It just makes me leave right away. So I need this moonlight somehow, and there's something going on right here. 
something <laughs> blooping up in the water. Can't touch it with the items I have. <laughs> I can't do anything over here, but I bet you I gotta check things out. Oh, wait, ooh, look at this sparkle over here. There's like colors now. Well, hello, death. I wonder if there's anything that was left behind. Oh, I can take the freaking fishing rod now. Can I take anything else as long as I'm treading back this way? I mean, I guess it's worth looking. These fireflies are pretty cute, though. Yep. Yeah. Oh. Okay. Interesting. So let's see what we can do do with the rod. Probably this right here. And then I get a bottle, and I broke the bottle. Happy day! Oh, the puppy. Oh God, I killed the dog. Oh God. Oh wait, no. Or did I let the dog go? Maybe I did let the dog go because remember I restarted it just to like test it out to see what would happen. Happy day. And there's a sun right here. Can I take the sun out of here? Aha, and it's very bright. Okay. So I can probably just plaster that up there and we're golden and we can see what's going on inside the old house. Holy shit, the robots bite. <laughs> That's the old house outside. Can I stop bleeding please? That'd be cool. I can go in deeper, but what's this? Spike is dead. I did not kill Spike, did I? That wasn't me. I think I let Spike go. I don't know, we'll see. Our family, dad, mom, me, and Spike. Huh. Now one thing to keep in mind is this is the bad ending. I wonder how different this would be if this was the good ending, you know? Oh, God. This looks like the bad part of Toy Story, man. Oh, God. What's up, baby? Oh, the baby's bite, too. Great. Everything's just a little nibbly around in here. Oh, look at his face. Oh. <laughs> I can go in deeper to the kids' room or to the parents' room. Oh, is that what you do? You keep screams inside there? Wow, that's unfortunate. Well, I'm not doing that again. Let's go. Oh, you keep screams in that one, too. What about this one? Okay. <laughs> Alrighty then. Bye, Spike. Oh no, not Spike. These are so sad. Do I gotta cut anything off of this one? It doesn't look like it. Oh, and there's death sitting in the distance. You see that? Interesting. So. I can take this rag. Can I shut you up? No. Something needs to be dirty ragged. <laughs> That's not an option yet, Jesus <laughs> Christ! Shut up! Okay. Well, I got a dirty rag. And something squeaked at me. You shut up, Teddy! Yeah, what about what, what the teddy bear, by the way? Was I able to cut anything off of this, by the way? I should take a look. No, nothing's choppy choppy up in here. Well, I have this dirty rag, which, oh, there's a, this opened up, thank you, I guess. What is this? Wipe that off, maybe? Okay. Toy guards. Oh, that's what you are. And you have a scissors. Anything else I can do with this before I head on out of here? So those are the toy guards. Does that mean they're gonna hurt me? Kinda seems like that. Hey, but I got a pretty wicked ass toy here. <laughs> You should be afraid of me. Oh, I can cut this. I just have to cut it right in the right area. Oh, God. Okay, well, I guess I'll go ahead and take those. Great. Where do you want me to put those, huh? Do you need one? Oh, I just cut them out just, just for funsies. Oh, or nah. Get out of here. So this must be death. And there I go. Wow, would you look at that? Well, you don't want me hanging out in this house. Okay, never mind. Can I go in through the back door? Huh? This kind of seems pretty... Pretty obvious that I would want to, you know, enter in this very convenient hole you have in the side of the... Of the place, you know? Of the building. But apparently not. Anything left in here now? Anything been changing? No. So let's start just going back in general. Maybe something happened over this way. But no! Nah. Okay. Well, well, we'll do a little bit of crowbar and force our way in, okay? Wow. I'm probably pissing him off so bad. So now I cut out the eye. Oh, look at this. I cut out the eyes of all these guys so they can't see me anymore. Oh, what's this? 
says Grandma and Grandpa and Mommy, but Daddy doesn't seem very happy. Unless that's the son. Looks like these two died, huh? Okay. This is so interesting. Actually, I should check that. Where was that? Do I need to cut this at all? Oh, never mind. My scissors is gone. Okay, found the scissors. Jesus, I'm not dead though, so that's good. That was a mean little trap you had there. Wait, I could do something with that? I can open it if I want to, I guess. And die a little more? Sure, why not? I don't know why I would do that. Oh, I got the scissors back. Okay. What's inside here? This is the kids' room. So the screaming was the guards, is what that was. They were watching. Man, there's so much to look at in here. What's this? Stay with me, Dad. Oh, no. So, Dad was the one that was sick. We knew that. We knew that the dad was going through treatments, or one of the parents was. We knew that. We did know that. They were sick. And we had to do something about it. Can I cut this at all? Anything to chop, chop, choppy, chop? No. God, whenever I hear that, I, like, start freaking out. We have a broom. Lots of ripped up wallpaper. And I'm not seeing anything. Oh, what's this? Dear Death, please don't take my parents. You can have all my toys. I'll clean my room every day, I promise. I know sometimes I'm rude and impolite, but I'll change. I'll do anything. Just don't take my parents, I beg you. I'm sorry I have to. Don't try to stop me. D. Wow. Didn't know Death left little notes for people. I'll consider it. <laughs> right. So what if he does stop him? Oh, yeah, you bit me. Why is everything biting me? What if you do stop him, huh? What is that gonna do? Let's go in the parents' room here. Oh, that's a clown. And these are tacks. We probably want to do that. There we go. And then... Okay, so we have a lock here. And there's something stuck inside. Well, I'll work on that. Quickest I can. I need to get a key or something, though. Which might be in that tree, right? Don't forget about that tree. So the mom must have died too. Happy Mother's Day. Who is the little kid then? I'm feeling like there's a... Not just one person suffering here because... This person... And then there's also... The little kid that was in the picture with this person with the hat. And I thought the person with the hat was the kid, but maybe it's not. Maybe the kid is the little, little kid? That we saw in the fridge? I'll show you what I mean when we get back out there. Well, let's keep investigating in here. Try to grab- Ah, oh, God! Everything is so nibbly! Jesus Christ! Stop! Okay, I feel like I shouldn't click anything that looks like halfway dangerous. But now in here there was a picture. Right there. You see how he's right there? Who is this? If these are the parents, like, I think the dad and the kid are suffering here. Or maybe the kid is a dad. I don't know. Something doesn't make sense here for sure. But let's try to figure out what's next. And hopefully not bleed anymore. God damn, I'm bleeding so much. Oh, hello! You still here? Get out. Oh, wow. Why are you so mad at me? Why are you so... I hate everything about this. Get that out of the way. Did you take all my items? Oh, you totally did, you shit. You took everything. So, what if I do go back? Can I go back this way? No, I can't. I have to go forward and see what the hell it is that's going on. Oh. Mountain. Oh, so what is death so protective about here? That's what I don't get. I don't get that at all. You're very grumpy about this whole situation, though. Let's go back inside, I guess. Keep poking around in business that I'm apparently not supposed to be poking around in. Took all my stuff. Can't even use those scissors anymore. Seriously, I have no items. Took them all. And this is still locked. Huh. So I need to find a key. Or items. Or something. Because everything's gone. McDuder took the whole gambit. Which uh, uh, oh, 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 my inventory. Holy shit. Worms and stuff. Well. There's my stuff. He threw it in the trash. Thank you. What else do I need? Glue? Rotten fish? Coin? Wait. I've been to these places, haven't I? I don't get the UFO, by the way. You remember the UFO from the very beginning of the game? <laughs> I don't get the UFO. 
Well, I got my stuff back, including a key. Last warning! Well, I need to draw this back up here, don't I? I need to do some scribbly wibblies. There's gotta be something I can do with this, for sure. So I need to find a pen somewhere. Is there a pen anywhere in here? It don't look like it. There's gotta be one somewhere. Oh, what's this? I got a handle off of here. So maybe I can use the handle to go over here and open this up. And what's this? <laughs> Parents' bedroom, basement. Okay. Well, we knew that. That's not anything new. Unless I need to cut this. Oh, I could just enter in through here. Okay, never mind. What the heck is down in here? That's no good. Okay, so the kid did not succeed in stopping death. But maybe that's what we're doing? Or are we death? Or not death, are we are we one of the parents? How dare you come here? Lots of coffee. I thought I made it clear that I don't want anybody coming here. I want to be alone. People are scared of me, they despise what I do. That child's drawings broke my heart. I don't want to take people away anymore and make them suffering. The world without me will be a better place. You can enjoy your eternal and endless life. Any accident or illness won't end up your lives. If you think I'm wrong and should come back to my work, prove it. Oh god. I doubt you'd find any argument, but you can try. Now leave me alone. Oh my. Oh my. And that's chapter seven, huh? The old house. Chapter eight. Exit. I think that's gonna be the final episode here, huh? And everything is dead quiet. Oh boy. Oh boy. Very. <laughs> SHUT UP! Very interesting. Is this just where we start? This final chapter. Right here. And there's no way out of the old house. That is immediately obvious. So we need to start figuring out what in the hell it is we need to do to figure out death and figure out how to convince death to keep being death. Cause death don't want to be death no more cause death don't like death and things. <laughs> Which is so incredibly interesting. But unfortunately, we have a battery from this toy car. Oh wait, do you think that's the car that started it? Oh dude, remember the drunk driving right in the beginning of the game? Oh, I wonder what has to do with what around in here, man. But again, we're going to have to stop here. Thank you guys for watching. If you stick around, you may see the next episode pop up right away if I already have it done. I'm just so, like, into this game right now. I feel like I'm just so invested in what's happening. The story is so devastating for sure. And I don't know what's going on or what we got to do. I do know we will figure it out. And we'll do it very soon. So, thank you guys. You are the best. I would appreciate it if you left a like on the video, and if you haven't already, go ahead and subscribe so you can see the rest of whatever the heck it is we gotta do around in here, and then I'll see you guys in the next video.